lot of you ask the question when it comes to UFO videos, why is the quality so bad? And I have a question myself. How come on TV, no matter the camera, no matter the crew, no matter the station, no matter the era, no matter who's being interviewed, there is this consistent problem that our cameras have. Um, you can say that the cameras are cheap. You can say that they are faulty. You can say that you can say whatever you want, that there's something wrong with the wiring in the cameras as to why certain people, only their bodies seem to just go haywire in front of a camera. Now, I'm not saying it happens all the time, but I am saying that when it does happen, the cop out is that it is the in this case fox it's not the woman it is fox and i'm just saying that maybe just maybe there is something to this reptilian hologram theory because it is awfully strange that even though the problem has been going on for years decades actually i wish i could have found older videos that i have but i just couldn't um, but it's a problem that for some reason the camera companies or the news companies or the engineers or hackers or whoever it is that is technical, it's a problem that they can't fix. And even on the other side, um, I do believe that this is a problem that can't be fixed. I believe that there is just something with a frequency that just has to do with our broadcasting and sometimes randomly for whatever reason it affects their technology it's really that simple it doesn't have to be complicated even though it is complicated because they can't fix it and i don't consider them stupid i do believe that they are superior when it comes to their intellect and to their capabilities but clearly there is something going on with the 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 radio frequency that comes out during these during these broadcasts and for whatever reason it distorts it distorts their ability to hide um, another thing that I can't really seem to wrap my mind around is the perfection that you apply to these beings or in other words they're not capable of making mistakes they're not capable of just being normal and not handling the business to the best of their ability most likely because they're comfortable i mean after you do something for so long it becomes second nature but every once in a while you just get accustomed to doing something a certain way and you miss something so i do think that whatever is happening that causes them to be exposed like this it is on their end they're not doing something that is just not preventing this now is it completely un again fixable i'm gonna say no because if that was the case then we would never see this problem i do think this is an individual basis when this does happen when it happens and there's just something that they are not doing that is keeping this from happening and another observation about this is that when you notice they all first get in front of the camera, everything is fine. It's only after exposure and after a time of being exposed to whatever this frequency is that is messing their signal up, you can clearly see that it it just deteriorates over time. It, it's, it's unbelievable. Um, so for me, I just don't understand, you know, the questions that are had sometimes by the non-believers as to quality, but then when it comes to quality on this end of it just being odd and absurd that there's just not more questions asked. I feel like that there should be a lot more questions asked when technical problems, consistent technical problems like this happen, that there should be more questions asked because I don't think that it's normal. I don't think that it can be helped, but I do think that it is 100% them hiding from us and being exposed. There's no doubt in my mind uh, because it only happens on their body. 
If it was something wrong with the camera, I just honestly feel like that everything would be messed up, but it's only the individuals. And to me, that speaks volumes. So there's plenty of, there's, there's plenty of footage out there that shows this, and it's always the same problem. It's never different. It's always the exact same problem. Their body is distorted. That's the only problem. Their body is distorted. It's incredible. You'll see a couple shots later on where it's their eyes. Again, they're not doing it on purpose. Well, one woman, I actually do think that she did it on purpose. I honestly think she looked into the camera. She made her eyes appear how they really are. And then she just went back to normal. And the reason I think she did this, I think she was sending a message not only to her higher ups, but our higher ups as well. I do believe that she had some sort of conversation with them and she was proving a point like, look, I can expose myself on live TV in front of the world and nobody will think anything about it. I really honestly believe that she did it. You can just see the intention in her eyes when she looks. She's looking at somebody. She's not looking at the camera and at the public. She is specifically talking to someone as in, look, this is what we can do, this is what I can do, and nobody will think twice about it. On her side, and as far as on our side with the government, I think she's letting the governments of the world know, look, we're here, there's nothing you can do about it, we're right here. What can you do? I'm exposing myself, and you're still not able to do anything. And you're forgetting the most important part, sleeper cells. What do they do? They infiltrate. For instance, look at Al-Qaeda. Look at some of the uh, sleeper cells that they had over here. For years, decades, had families. Germans as well, Nazis. You would have no idea. And you wouldn't expect it. So just give them more credit for hiding. Everybody thinks they're going to be in dark alleys, wearing weird clothes, talking crazy, just being gringy, grimy criminals. That's not how you infiltrate. Well, you can infiltrate that way, but you're not going to accomplish anything. They're smarter than that. They're hiding right in front of us. Be aware, fame doesn't matter. Status, our societal status of anything doesn't matter. They're everywhere, as well they should be. Give them credit, as usual. <laughs>